I don't count so this is crooked or I'm crooked something's crooked either way welcome to your December read for this current year dear cancers and cancer people who are watching forum alike cancer this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Please check your charts. If this resonates with you, good deal. If not, don't worry about it. Just boop your nose and away it goes, right? No point in stalling yourself on shit that doesn't pertain to you, right? Right. Mind you, I like to say curse words, especially the F-bomb. So if that makes you uncomfortable or you get offended, don't watch my shit. Because, you know, you're, it's just going to hurt you more than it will me. I promise. Newcomers. You want a personal read? The first one is on the house. All the information is in the description box below. I do take tips and donations, though. Just a thought. Thank you very kindly in advance. All right. Your energy is judgment, Cancer and Crosswatcher alike. Ooh, what are you judging? Who dares face the wrath? You know, I found this really crazy, like, little meme on Facebook earlier about what weapons like the Zodiacs used. You and Aries had like you would kill somebody with your bare hands. I would use a gun because I'm a Capricorn and I'm not getting shit on my clothes. Anyway, so far you got judgment call. Either you're trying to resurrect something, you're trying to figure something out. But then we also got the page of pentacles in the situation and they are reversed. Which means they're kind of an idiot. They're not very skilled. Like, they can't make anything on their own. That pentacle that's right there, they didn't make that. They got that off fucking eBay and they ain't even gonna tell you about it. This also deals with social settings as well, so someone could be acting like a fucking ass to you. In a really immature way. Like, it'd be different if it were reversed and they didn't know what they were doing. But this person's like, mm-mm. They're like, immature. And they don't want to deal with people very well. Your wants and wishes, ten of pentacles, you might be feeling like you're the backbone of the family. They play games on you. However, the obstacle and challenge is keeping your guard up and staying on duty and not falling asleep with the knight of pentacles, with the knight of wands, my apologies. Fears and rejections, death reverse. Something not dying. It's like you're having a hard time killing something off, right? Yeah, we got a book for y'all really quick out of this one. Someone slowly but surely, like, coming with an offer. But that's because they lost the war after winning an insignificant battle or skirmish. Right? And they're kind of childish and shit. Like, they act like a child whenever they don't get their way. They refuse to fall with the tower. They'd rather just stay suspended and be in the dark about everything rather than actually look things over and figure out what the fuck. You know? Hmm. How interesting. And that's all with the death reverse. How this shit goes, how it starts, how it'll end, how it'll bring this cycle to full circle. Wish. I don't like when wishes come up for you guys, because every time like I've ever seen a wish that's nine of cups right here with you guys, it always seems like it comes with a really bad strings attached, but it's up right now, so maybe it's not going to be that bad this time. Your beginning theme, there's an opportunity that was missed and you just knocked over your cup being like, fuck it, I don't want to look at this cup, it tastes like grape juice. And I deserve Chardonnay. Okay. Cancer, I feel like you're like... It's like you got the right idea about something, but it's like you've kept guard for so long, you don't know how to bring something to an end. It's like there's something here that, like, just struck you. You got a page of pentacles, an idiot right here. Doesn't know what they're doing, doesn't know how to socialize. Something to do with, like, being the backbone. And then, like, here's a wish right here, and I'm not sure how that all connects, but we're gonna find out. Alright, Cancer and Crosswatcher, this judgment card, right? Someone's got the right idea or they feel like resurrecting something, but something is not happening for them. There's no energy for it with the Eight of Wands. You know, fates come in on a relationship somewhere where it looked like it was a really happy marriage. And nah, it's over. It's done. It's like, I don't want to look at your face. Or how it began was all nice and roses. And now it's just like you're attached to somebody who um, you don't like. Didn't I say that about you guys last time? Like, there's something you don't like and you need to get rid of it? Or some shit? No, that was on your full moon thing. I remember that. It was just like, there's something you don't like anymore. And I think you want to get rid of it. 
you know, lots of combativeness, but still a fear of going into the unknown because you don't know what's out there. Like you would take that leap of faith, but it's so dark. You're kind of like, I, I don't want to, I don't want to fall and bust my face. That'll hurt. And I'm allergic to pain. Down below in the situation with this page of pentacles, right? Could be Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. Someone just does not know. We got the two of cups right here. Someone's really stupid when it comes to romance or some shit. Or how to love somebody. And it got to the point where like they just decided to walk away despite that their cups were full. Like maybe they cared about somebody, but their inability to actually like be skilled when being social or giving people what they want. Um, it almost like it drove them to walk away despite the fact they still had a lot of love here, right? Ten of Pentacles. So it feels like the backbone. Definitely based more on relationship reasons. It's like if there's a family, it's like the person in the backbone is definitely in the relationship stage. And they're just like, I love this person. They are my person. But now they got to turn their back to it. Becky's not only bored, but she's just like, ah, don't touch me. You smell like fucking cheese, Greg, today. I don't want to deal with it. Like someone's all moody and shit. Like not showing their love, not showing their appreciation. I'm dropping one more on that. Like, is there someone you're connected to, Cancer and Cross Watcher? Because there seems like there's still some disaster you're afraid to look at. I'm not sure what that means. Like, where is that coming from? Like, why is the King of Swords, like, overlooking something that's disastrous that's happened? Like, you were connected to somebody, then you, you, somebody turned their back, most likely you, Cancer, Cross Watcher, and now it's like there's a disaster in the distance. It's lightning bolts and shit. It's like... Oh, this is the final boss stage, isn't it? I don't know if I want to go in there. I'm wearing a lot of metal for a guy who's supposed to be king. You know? <laughs> like, this is like, should I really be standing outside while it's lightning bolt? Because I'm going to get my ass zapped. Obstacles and challenges. Not waiting for nothing. Hmm. You were on guard for something, but then you, but it's like you have to realize with this obstacle and challenge that you, that there was nothing to wait for. And you gotta stop with that shit, because there's already no inaction up here. Uh, I feel like something, like, Cancer, I feel like you were about to, like, go in a battle with somebody up here. And you didn't take the steps to do so. Or you were expecting somebody to walk up and start their shit with you. So you could be like, I got a volcano. We're going to go right now. You know, like you, you bit, nobody came forward. And now it's like you realize you were waiting for nothing. You know, and the, and the indecision was like based on emotions. Hmm. Fear of rejections with this death card reverse, right? Not wanting, you too afraid or not wanting to end something. Still wanting to look like a victor, I see. But there's a fucking mistress. It could be you. It could be Pisces per Cancer and Cross Watcher. Ah, uh, is there an affair going on? Because that's my mistress card. Like, she was discovered, or she was figured out, or something. She didn't approach. Someone just happened to find her name was Fred, but there were nudes on the phone, you know? It, it, it's kind of like that. Like, someone went snooping and be like, who the fuck is this bitch? You know? Oh, my cancer. What in the world are you into? But it's like a fear. Being afraid something won't end as a mistress. Cancer, I really hope you're not trying to fuck somebody's relationship up. Like, I'm telling you, it's not a good idea, but it's whatever, man. Like, it's your life. I'm not going to tell you what to do. I'm just saying, this doesn't sit well with me. I don't know if it's you. I don't know if it's Pisces. I don't know if it's the person you're dealing with. I have no idea who the hell this is, honestly. But I don't like this at all. Or did you find out somebody else had a mistress? Mmm. 
Interesting, interesting, interesting. Full circle card. How's this shit start, title, end? There was a wish. Cancer, every time you, there's a wish with you guys, it's like, oh dear. Every time I read it for you guys. Wow. There's definitely something burning over yonder. You're looking over this way and you're being like, ah, I don't know why I want to go there. But there is a phoenix and the phoenix represents rebirth and you might go that direction. Following your intuition in order to get this wish established. Okay, this is not bad. This so bothers me a lot. Way too much. Like, I don't know why. Let's see. What's the ending theme? Oh, wow. What a... Okay, well, that's actually kind of a strange shot. This person's sitting here waiting for somebody to come back, and then they get to the point of just letting that emotion go, just being like, it's not going to happen. Hmm. That is very interesting. Cancer, I'm very confused about your reading, but we're going to continue anyway, because you'll know, like, like I, I get confused in the readings anyway, but, like, yours is, like... It's like you're waiting for, for someone to come back so you can fight them. Or you're expecting somebody to come after you, either for being a hoe or because they're a hoe, and it's like, I don't know. It's like, there's, a, it, I know there's more than just two people, I know there's more than three people for sure, but it's like, who is who, Cancer and Crosswatcher? Back up in this situation up yonder with your energy. Um, someone's giving shit to a gnome and treating them like a gnome, but lesser than. You'd be like, come here, you little fuck. Uh, I got some for you. I said hurry up before I changed my mind, right? It definitely could be this page of pentacles just treating you like shit, right? And then it's like you sit there and you want to, like, work things out with them. Like, delegate. Uh, parlay. Have a discussion. I feel like this person feeds you bullshit just to keep the peace, Cancer and Crosswatcher. And they give you the least amount that they have to. It's one thing to treat somebody like a gnome, but it's another thing to treat them like they're fucking worthless. You know. Let's see. Situation. Got three on that. Yeah, someone was all, like, happy with how they treated somebody because the ending to a third-party situation... But this is always, for me, like, someone didn't mean to do it, but they're just putting on a facade so they don't look weak. Or, like, they don't care. Uh, I knew a cancer would do that. They'd just be like, I don't care. Even after, like, they decided to fuck me over really bad and, like, all sorts of shit. Oh, my phone's about to die. Holy fuck. Let's put that shit over yonder. Um... But it did end the third party situation, but now it's like someone's been spying and other people are coming up like, look, dude, you gotta stop. You gotta figure out what it is you're doing, right? Let me go put my phone on charge real quick. My bad. I didn't know my phone was gonna die that quick. It was at like 75% before I started this shit. You charge away and play my awesome sauce music phone. Okay. But yeah, it's like now people are coming up to you being like, put down the gun, young blood. It's time. Don't be doing this shit. It's like you're gathering. It's like there was information given that made you put your sword down. Like, did you fight somebody or something or? Or do people come up saying, like, hey, you're in the wrong, and you listen to them all the time? Don't listen to fucking people, Cancer. People are fucking stupid. Listen to yourself. Um, you know, listen to your heart when he's calling for you. Or whatever that song is by the Barracuda Lady. You know? It's wants and wishes. Someone's got some tricks, but they keep fucking up on their horse. Like they tripped over it, the horse's legs are broke, so now they gotta like put the horse down, which I think is ridiculous. We have technology to help other animals, we should do the same with the horse. Like who cares if they break their legs? They're still alive. We can help them, we can give them new legs, you know? Like, oh dear, there we go. 
go. We got three piles. Two seconds. These two can go up. I don't care. They were down facing. Uh, doing tricks to try to get out of a bad situation, but it's like someone keeps getting under your skin to pull you back in, Cancer. And Cross Watcher. It's like someone's tricks didn't work, and now everyone's out in the cold. Olga's like carrying her shit on her back. People are watching her. Yeah, very much so. Okay, look at this, right? Someone's tricks didn't work. Olga here is leaving, and these two are still sitting here. And it's almost like this dude represents this guy over here, and the chick looking at Olga represents dude over here, because he's still looking for her, too. And it's like, are you going to leave me like this motherfucker did? Are you going to leave like this fat bitch right here? Because nobody likes Olga because she's fat, but this person doesn't care. They love Olga. They're looking at Olga like, where are you going, Olga? Where are you going? You make the best cookies, man. You know, like, it's one of those things where the person's, like, looking at the sea if you're going to leave, too. And I don't like that shit. It's like, they're surprised that this person got somewhere. But still, it's like somebody's tricks. It's like they hesitated. You know? Um, someone walked away because they felt like none of these options were useful. Or whatever options were chosen were shit. Right? And someone had to let something go. Or they have to let it go. But they still went on the attack against somebody they separated from. That's Wow, that's kind of crazy, Cancer and Crosswatcher. Look at this. Like, this shit needed to be let go, and instead someone came in to, to fucking, like, battle and shit to attack somebody. Which caused even more of a separation, I feel like. The fuck is going on, y'all? What's going on? What's going on? Down in the obstacles and challenge, you gotta make someone feel better. With a rose, a flower, anything that delves into your love and power, just don't choke them out like a fucking lot. Oh, what? Are we trying to, okay. Someone's trying to come and be nice to somebody just so they can choke the fuck out of them. I don't like this energy, Cancer and Crosswatchers. Like, whatever this is right here, you can go visit somebody and they'll come right behind you and choke the fuck out of you. That's dangerous, whoever that is. What is that? Mm, I don't know if I like that. Fears and rejections. Someone doesn't feel like themselves anymore. Ooh, you get three on this one, too. Uh, they got caught up in their bullshit, and now someone doesn't want to share their world with them? Ooh, Cancer and Crosswatcher. If there was somebody in the background, like, fucking around in your relationship, or, you know, you could be doing this, too. No judgment. I don't give a fuck what you do. It's your life. Whatever. Um, either way... Like, whatever this is, this mistress in this, um, I think she was victorious. But she also got caught up in the bullshit, too. And it's like, now no one wants to be with her, or the person you, you were with, Cancer, or maybe even you, doesn't want to be with their person. Someone's, like, separating because of this mistress. Because they got found out. Oh, I love this song. It's so sexy. Anyway. Let's see. The full circle. How this shit starts, how it ends. Love is gone. Flew fuck away. And now you gotta get rid of your love for it. Once again, the four of cups. You're pouring that shit down. You've been sitting here waiting for something, and now you gotta let that weight go. What was this again? What the fuck? Come here. Come here. There's something you want to go to, some sort of phoenix rising, and your intuition is telling you what it is, but it's like, there's something you gotta let go of. Hmm. It's like someone didn't offer their love, and now it's gotta be drained somewhere else crazy tasty or they didn't give the love to somebody and now there's like a regret because they didn't give their love the person never came back and now they got to release that cup and that's how it ends too is this quite depressing i'm sorry 
for anyone dealing with this cancer, but that's the end of your read. So if you enjoyed this, like, share, and subscribe. I'll appreciate it. And I feel for you, man. Whoever it is dealing with this shit show, I don't know what the fuck this is. This feels like, what is it what the kids call situation shits? That kind of thing. But I will see you guys later. I love your faces. Please take care, okay? Love you. Bye-bye.